Oh god. What a mess I am. Yeah. Maybe I should have looked in the mirror before I decided to go live. <laughs> uh -oh. What's going on? Look at everybody. Hello, hello, hello. We are back again painting. Um, so, did you guys check out my previous video? I just put it up. It's pretty cool. We're going to be doing um, shout outs and question and answers. I think this is something that's going to continue forward. Thank you to Monster, Monstrous Little Beast for putting that together. I was really excited when I saw it was only like 20 questions and not 100 questions. If it was 100 questions, we'd definitely have to bring it. Hey, Chinza, did you notice that you're now a moderator? Um, I put you as a moderator, so feel free to punish as you need, as you see fit. So we've got a lot of moderators in this group. Yeah, you are. If you see that little wrench next to your name, you are. Uh, I was looking at my moderators and I was like, some people don't join in regularly, so I'm trying to make a few people I kind of know. Well, I know you, but other people are moderators, but I don't know them as well. But they're pretty good folks, so. Yes, now you're in charge a little bit there. I'm going to turn this. Oh yeah, I thought I told you, Jen, yesterday I got your kit. I, I emailed you back on your message and I said I got your kit in the mail. So I did get it. So we have a lot of babies I'm working on, as always. Right now we're going to be working with um, a zombie really cool i'm so glad you're loving your new baby it's totally awesome guys rainbow loom world no hello rainbow loom world but Jin on here just got a reborn doll for me it's her first baby for me and she's really excited with him so yeah let's see if you had to choose between wee baby luna i would probably keep luna um maple i like her i like them both but i'd probably keep her so we're gonna be working with this zombie first he's a work in progress or she I don't know if it's a he or she I think it's a she super cute I totally love how she's turning out I'm like loving her so we're gonna do a layer of this uh, can't call it a sherbet orange it's like a I don't know what it is like a it's like a it's like a, a white orange <laughs> If that makes any sense. Now, I thought I was hot, cold, so I'm gonna put my fan back on me. Okay, my <laughs> your hair looks long. You know what? Yeah, I need a haircut. It definitely uh, is longer. I need a haircut, and I lost my sponge. Where is my sponge? Oh, there it is. I need a haircut, and I need Jackie. Or well, I can color it myself because it's not gonna be bleached. So. Yeah, my wife does have beautiful skills. She's really good at this hobby. I think she's the better of us, too. I enjoy her work. Let's see. Oh, Zinnia, sweetie. Just finished watching your last video. Loved it. Ra yeah, Raven is super cute. Oh, my gosh. Ever since I made her a girl, I'm like, wow, she's so cute. That's the first Saskia that I've made that... I saw as a girl. Most of my Saskia's have been boys. Well, that was a team effort between Jackie and I. So she had like got him started. I finished him and then her and then she rooted her hair. So yeah. But um, so as you saw in the last video with shout outs and questions and answers, it looks like Monstrous Little Beast is going to be picking people who uh, I don't know how she determined that they needed a shout out, <laughs> but it's pretty good. So whatever, however she's determining it, it's working out. Um, thank you, Chenza, for posting the time. I definitely need to get a clock. I need, I need a clock so you guys can see it. I'm going to be getting one. Wait, what time? Oh, what time it is in California. It's like where I am, it's like a super common regular question in here. What time is it? What time is it? It's like very common, super frequent. 
So, yeah, I do need to get a clock in here. Let me put this down here so you guys can see what I'm doing a little better. You don't have to look at my ugly face because right now it's ugly. So, yeah. So, and then she grabbed, like, questions from the video, which was really awesome because there's always so many questions and I just don't see it. Oh, hey, uh, Joan, are you the one that bought the Real Born Ashley that I had for sale? I'm going to wait and see if she answers. Because she just said I can't wait. Whoa, that's really right. I can't wait for my Real Born Ash my Reborn Ashley. Why is that so bright? Oh, that's so awesome. Sweet. I'm shipping her out tomorrow. I had to go get a blanket and a box today. So she's shipping tomorrow. But how cool... That's so awesome. I love it when, um, sometimes, a lot of the time, believe it or not, when I sell on eBay, I don't know who the dolls are going to. And I almost, like, didn't think I was going to know who it was going to because it looked like, um, uh, the, the address is different, so. I thought it was, like, going to a store or something, I don't know. But that's so cool. She'll be living in the land of Oz. Yes, I did see that. She's perfect. Oh my gosh, I love that doll. I had actually, I didn't tell anybody, but I had created, no, some people did know that come and visit me at my house. I actually created that doll for myself. Um, I created her for myself, but then I started getting other kits and I kind of have to pick and choose which I'm going to keep. So, yeah, that's why she went for sale, but she's adorable. Like, Jackie didn't want me to sell her. She was like, are you really going to sell that doll? And I was like, yeah, because I have this other doll that I want and I just can't keep everything. So she's super cute. I love this. <laughs> Chinza, you are so on the ball with these. <laughs> I see Chinza popping up left and right. You go, girl. So, um, yeah, you're going to love Ashley. Super cute. But... So we're just doing this orange white wash on this Abby. It's Abby by uh, AK Kitagawa. I love that kit. Makes for the perfect zombie baby for sure. <laughs> also, Jackie is selling her lover babies. Oh, Jackie did sell them all, actually. She sold out of all her lover Bella dolls. I still have my Hispanic girl, Camila. She still has her Hispanic girl, but that's an open version, and I and I play with her in my videos, as you guys saw. Uh, she sold them because I think that she jumped the gun in wanting to buy them all. I really did think she was a little crazy when she said she was going to buy them all. But hey, I don't stop her from doing what she wants to do. And then, um, <laughs> Bub and Squirt Nursery, that is such a cute nursery name. I, <laughs> I totally love... You guys know that I love unique um, YouTube names. They always catch my attention. So, yeah, so she decided to sell it, and they sold really, really fast. Am I going to have more Reborns for sale on eBay? I do have more Reborns for sale on eBay. Um, and if Chinza is a kind soul, which Chinza is, Chinza might get you that link to my eBay, so just watch and see if Chinza posts it. But I have a baby on eBay right now. Tambry has a baby on eBay for sale. And Jackie has her two prototypes on eBay for sale. So, um, yeah, we'll see if Chinza shares the link. But if not, um, our name is, um, uh, yeah, Reborns. In Love With Reborns 2011 dash Heart to Heart Babies. But it looks like Chins is working on getting that link. So awesome. So oh, yes. Yeah, I raised the camera because right now I'm not doing anything. I'm just talking. I'm not selling any silicone dolls. I go back and forth. You can grab it too, Darcy. The more the merrier. Anybody puts it up there because it's only going to be one link. And as you see, comments fly. So, yeah. Um, I go back and forth between selling my Miko. You guys know who Miko is? But I just, I'm not sure. So, yeah. I don't know. Thank you, Chenza. You rock. You guys are great. All of you are great. Ah, look at that. The Reborn King put my thing up there. Oh, the Reborn King, your Walter, is coming along so sweet. I'll probably be working on him later tonight. 
Yeah. So, um, I would buy Miko right now. So, do you have do you have three thousand dollars? Because that's how much Miko is. I'm telling you, the first person to give me three thousand dollars plus shipping, <laughs> I'm selling Miko. But you know, I've had people ask, but I haven't had anybody that's like legit sure. So if you're legit and you want to buy Miko, just email me. But don't waste my time for a free baby doll. It's not gonna happen. Does Jackie still make cuddle babies? Yes. Jackie does make cuddle babies. Um, she has a few heads to make some cuddle babies, but right now she's uh, finishing, she's working on customs. So when she gets a break, she'll probably make a cuddle baby. Let me see, maybe my fan's up too high. Sorry, I have this little fan blowing on me and it's really making my eyes water. Okay, I just turned it down so now it feels better. What's a cuddle baby? It's where she just paints the head of a reborn kit and then attaches it to a full cloth body. Its arms are cloth, its legs are cloth, and they're weighted. They're really cool. I think they're really neat because they pose really well. I mean, you do have to keep them in long sleeve, long shirts, socks, and hand mittens on. But when we get like extra heads around here, because we'll mix up limbs and stuff, um, they're really cool. They're kind of like a cabbage patch doll, I guess. Cuddle babies are generally kind of around four hundred dollars. I was I was uh, doing three fifty with painted hair, or five hundred with rooted hair. I know it sounds like a lot, but once it's all broken down, it makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It does. Um, we don't have a lot of heads laying around. We have, I have an Ashley head, mm -hmm. and I have. Jeez, do you remember that Marina Winters doll that you gave me because you let me have the limbs? Oh, is that a ta a Tavi head? Yeah, Tavi. A Tavi head by Marina Winters, and then we have this random head because um, one of the companies that I buy kits with. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, it's, um, uh, it's uh, Krista Goatsen. Yeah, she said, I have this extra head I don't need. Do you guys want it? And I was like, sure. So she mailed us So her, I have three cuddle baby heads. Her spare head. But I was thinking if they didn't sell as a custom, I was going to have them available for adoption at the Rose Doll Show. Yeah. Jillian just said hi on here from the Twisted Bean. Hi, Jillian! Wait, she's still with Bean? Yeah. What? I thought it was a two-day thing. Maybe she leaves later tonight or tomorrow. I don't know exactly the details. Let's see. What's your opinion on the Mikey kit? Oh, my gosh. I love him. Ugh. That's another kit, the Mikey kit. I love because its addition is super small. I want to say... It's 150 edition or 300. Really small. Um, that kid I bought for myself too, but I, you know, can't keep everything. He, he has this really newborn expression. I love it. Um, hand, he has nice hands and feet. I honestly like that kit a lot. So, um, yes, the the Mike the Mikey kit is really cute. Like. And it has beautiful blue eyes. Beautiful. So, you know, I'm sorry. Um, I can I do try to read all the messages, but you know, you guys gotta be on my end. There's a lot of messages that come through. So I, if it's like free doll or shout out or stuff like that, I kind of don't really see those ones as much as like I see the paragraphs coming up. So I'm sorry. I'm really trying to keep up with you guys. Let's see. I wanted to pop in and say thank you for having such an awesome channel. Your work's amazing and inspiring. Your hair painting tutorials have helped me so much. Oh, you're welcome, Tabitha Kelly. You are very welcome. Who made the, um, uh, Mikey? It's Angela starts with a D. <laughs> I don't know. It's, um, it's, a. Uh, She's not a really well-known sculptor, but I, I like her work. Isn't that illegal? Isn't what illegal? It's all dolls. Don't worry about it. We're not selling real babies. They're dolls. Let's see. Will you move? 
Do more videos with Molly? Yes, I'm going to be working on doing more videos with Molly. That is my plan. I'm going to be doing the Molly videos as, um, yeah. Oh, thank you, MJ Baggett. Yes, I don't ask for gifts. If you guys send them, I totally appreciate it, but, um, you know, I don't ask for them. So, yeah, I will be doing more Molly videos for sure. When are you mailing out Molly shirt? Sherpoo66, if I owe you a Molly shirt, email me so with your address so I can get that to you. I know that um, one Molly shirt is going to go with Jackie's Customs. That's uh, the two heads you're rooting. Yeah, I know. And then another Molly shirt. Oh, I need to email. So behind. <laughs> Info is in Stephanie's video. Oh, look, monstrous little beast is in here. Awesome. Oh yeah, you know what? I never cashed your check, and I don't know where that check went. I'm gonna have to recheck my fridge. But email me. You have my email. I'm pretty sure. Uh, did you sell your baby con? No, I have sprinkles. I just haven't made any videos with her. I um. Probably should make some videos with her. <laughs> I love this. There's so many people in here working as a team. Like, people are re-asking questions and they're like, check my la check her last video for the answers. It's so awesome. You guys are awesome. I uh, know I don't need any clothes for Allie. Actually, I no longer have Allie. I um, sold her to Deja Collections, so she should be in Ireland very soon. I do Bub and, Bub and Squirt Nursery. It's pretty cool. It's a cute little name. <laughs> I love this, man. I got some moderators in here and then some other people who are just like really cracking down on the questions. The answers are in the last video. <laughs> so awesome. Okay, so we're going to be moving on. I've done the layers. Actually, we're not going to be moving on very much. Hold on. Change your mind. I don't know. I'm going to work on the lips on the zombie a little bit. I'm going to bring you guys down here so you guys can get a better view. But I am, the next step after I do this layer on all of these doll kits I have right now, we'll be working with um, blushing. We're going to jump into blushing and see where my doll kits are. And I'm just going to let you guys know I am not looking at the camera right now. So I'm totally missing all your questions, everything like that. Let's see. Uh, Jackie is to the next to me. They're like, can Jackie peek in? <laughs> I don't know if she'll peek in, but I did tell her that you have requested. Donovan, I sold Donovan I'm to. Team. You can see the head a little bit. <laughs> I sold Donovan to a girl on Instagram. I just don't think the bigger babies are really for me. I don't know. Just, you well, you guys know how it goes with me and my dolls. They don't stick around very long. But yeah. So we're just doing some lip work. Do I have any black reborn baby dolls? Um, in my collection, I have, well, I have one that's got an Indian tone. I do have one coming from Cat Magistry, which I still owe her a little bit of money on. But he is, he's an ethnic baby. I, um, let's see. I used to make biracial dolls, but I'm working on one biracial doll as a custom. It was a painted kit. It's a Kimberly. She's cute, but she's giving me quite the headache. Um, seems like lately when I do biracial work, I struggle with it. I don't know why. Guys, if you, okay, to my moderators, if we have somebody who's continuously asking for free dolls, go ahead and just put them in time out. Don't block them. So put them in time out. Um, that way, you know, they kind of get the hint that they got to stop. Because I see a lot of people are bothered by somebody asking for free dolls. I'm not paying attention because I think they're, I think they know that I'm looking down so then that's when they ask for free doll. <laughs> They're like, oh, Stephanie's not paying attention? I'm going to ask for a free doll. So we just worked a little bit with the lip color and um, 
Oh yeah, my African American twins are really cute. You're right, I like them a lot. Jody does some really nice work. All right, so I'm gonna grab another doll kit. We're gonna go into another doll kit. Um, we're gonna go, all right. Sorry, I'm just grabbing my kit over here, deciding which one I wanna do. I have like three of them hanging out. We're gonna work with this one. This one I've been working on for a few days now. This is the um, Sasha. Sasha. Will you paint your Asian doll sitting on your paint tables? Uh, yeah, I haven't decided what I'm doing with that doll quite yet. Um, I will be painting it, but that one is it's in the works. Not sure. Not sure what I want to do. I'm going to bring a little painting thing over here a little closer. This little baby. Get Sasha going. The blue thing is the moderators, yes. The ones that people come up and they have a little wrench by their name. <laughs> Beggars, please catch a, <laughs> catch a clue. Yeah. Okay. If you want to draw me something and mail it to me, feel free. You don't have to ask. You can just send it. Let's see. I don't know how you're probably buying straws, Lula's. Oh, yeah. It's just, um... <laughs> You know what it is with the biracial dolls is like, okay, so I go through a pattern like where I'm painting biracial, 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 and then I'll go through a pattern where I'm painting just Caucasian babies, and then like a custom will throw a wrench in the Caucasian thing, and they're like, I want a biracial, and I don't do biracials as much as I used to, so it's like I'm stuck in the Caucasian pattern, and so when I start working in the, uh, ethnic tones I start to be like oh my gosh I don't know what to do next like and then the, I feel like the doll kit argues with me and it's just like it doesn't do whatever I want it to do have you ever painted with a double crown oh no I have not I should try that that would probably be really cute um I've never painted a double crown I think I have asked Jackie to root a double crown something like that she kind of thought I was out of my mind I remember asking for something like that so yeah maybe I should try painting a double crown that would be cute thank you for that idea <laughs> so we're doing again we're, all these dolls are just getting all the same like a uh, white orange layer <laughs> and um <laughs> little red riding hood <laughs> if, will you ever do the unicorn hair or mermaid hair? It was so cool. What do you mean? I don't know. You've done that? I don't think I've ever painted unicorn hair or mermaid hair. Hello, Robin. I don't think I've ever painted those color. The only uh, crazy color hairs I've painted were on the clowns. Okay. Ooh. Let's see. How many dolls? <laughs> how many dolls do I think I've painted since I started painting? A million. <laughs> Not a million. Stuff. Oh, that's good. I've painted. Gosh. Um. A million and two. <sighs> What would you think I've painted? A lot. Gosh, I couldn't even begin to think. Um, let's just say I paint, like, let's say I paint $10 a month. Okay, let's just say. On an average, that's 600 a year. Wait, what? No. $10 a month is not 600 Okay, $10 a month, that's $120 a year. 120 times oh. 6 gives you over 600. I would probably say close to a thousand. So 700 and yeah. I'd probably say like around a thousand dolls. I've painted a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Um, a lot of them. My favorite reborn kit, you know, I really don't have a favorite reborn kit. I am looking forward to the journey coming out. I can't wait to see her. I'm hoping that she's bigger than Americus 
Lounge. I'm hoping she's more like Laura Lee Eagles um, Everly size kit. I do have a love a uh, love a boy love a bow doll. I have him. There's videos with him actually. Yeah, I pre-ordered her kit. I got two of them. I was like, I'm hoping she's going to be the one. Because I would like to keep her in my collection. Wow. Why don't you guys put that Ruthie Cyrus in a timeout? I swear, some people, it's like, where are your behavior skills? All right, awesome. I saw that frequently asked questions thing go up. So cute. Would I ever paint a Smurfette? Um, no. I mean, if I got accustomed to paint a Smurfette, I would. But I would never just paint one. What's a double crown? You know when you have the swirl in the back of your head? Sometimes you can have two of them, one on each side of your head. So that's what a double crown is. The Levi kit. I love the Levi kit. It's very cute. Let's see. Don't worry, Baby Reborn Collective. Someone asked me on one of my lives, how often should send a doll in for a tune-up, get rid of the shine and wear, maybe be rooting? Um, I mean, it just depends upon how hands are you are with your doll. Like, my dolls, well, when I've had dolls in the past that I've had long enough to need a tune-up, um, when I was really hands-on with Heavenly, and I don't, this is, you know, really aging the channel here. I don't know if you guys remember, but I um, had her for almost a year and she did need a tune-up. She did need, like, spots patched back in for rooting and she did need her shine taken away. But if you're not hands-on with your dolls a lot, like, I'm not hands-on with the dolls that I have in my collection too much so they pretty much stay in new condition but honestly if you're hands-on with your dolls quite a bit I would say maybe eight months to a year but if you're overly hands-on with your dolls you could need a, tu uh, a tune-up sooner it just depends honestly how much you're changing them um, you know if you're changing them morning and night maybe afternoon the more you change them the more you're gonna wear on their varnish so it, that just really depends on the person, but I do recommend them. I mean, I have done, I've done tune-ups on some of my dolls that the collectors have had for like three years, and it's not a tune-up because it's like worn down. It's a tune-up because my painting style was so different, so I just add like, you know, my newer style into it, just make it look more fresh and like what I do now. So that would pretty much do that. What can you do to, to reduce shine? Stop changing the doll so much. Um, <laughs> that's pretty much it. Let's see. Assuming the doll was varnished appropriately. Yeah, before. assuming it was var varnished appropriately. Yeah, there's like, it's just, there's, <sighs> normal wear is, uh, it's like a huge spectrum because, okay, uh, there is normal wear and tear to your dolls. If you're playing with your dolls, because you know, they are art pieces, but if you're playing with your dolls and you're changing them, let's just say you have this one doll, you're changing it morning and nighttime, every single day, and you're brushing it. I really think probably in a few months you're going to need a tune-up on that doll. It's going to start to shine. They're just not made. We do our best to make sure that, you know, their painting does longevity and stuff. And I always tell people, you know, when you're putting the clothes on, stretch it over the hand, stretch it over the feet, or put socks on the feet, then put the clothes on. Because, so that way the material is not constantly rubbing on the doll. I always tell them when you put the headbands on their hair, stretch the headband, then put it on the head. Don't slide it on the hair because that's what starts breaking off the hair. When you put them in their car seat, so you don't damage the back of their hair, you know, make their hair get a bald spot, you just, you pick them up don't have their head like slide, you know, on the car seat. So there's just different things. There's little things that you can do to make your doll's artwork go a long way. But 
if you're hands on with your doll all the time, it's, you know, it's just, the, it's wear and tear. Just like anything, you know, you buy a, a baby life from Walmart, hands on with it all the time, it, it's wear and tear. So it's all normal though. I mean, it, it's bound to happen. Like I said, you know, I touched up dolls that I love. I've touched up some dolls that, you know, people what are like, are it's feet are shiny, it's because I change it all the time. It's, it's totally normal. Yeah, good night to you too. Honey. I muted you guys for a second. I'll be right back. Love you too. Love you All right. Good night. Love you too. <laughs> God. All right. Now you can hear me. I took you guys off of mute. <laughs> How do you mute? There's like a, in the corner of my screen, it's three buttons. Press it and it gives me the mute option. Have a good night, uh, Gianna's Baby World Reborn. Let's see. <laughs> the monitors are really working today. <laughs> I don't have a Quentin or a Tate. New, okay, so this baby I did. Uh, you know what, I was supposed to do something else on this baby before I did this. Got my orange leg wash on this one. So we're gonna rotate kits again. I'm gonna grab a different one. I wanted to do something else with that doll before I did that orange wash, but it's okay. You live and learn. We'll just do it after this. Alright, so let me get this one. This is um this is Emma by Natalie Scholl that I'm working on. So here she is. You guys saw me start working on her, I think, last night. So there she is. She's cute. This kit is adorable. I've had this kit in my collection a couple times, um, but she never sticks around. I don't know. And then sometimes I'm tempted, tempted to keep her and see if she'll stick around, but we'll see. Yeah, she's really cute. She's a sold out kit. So this is the one I'm working on now. We're gonna get into our, I wanna do the orange wash on her. There she is. All right, what kit Molly is the Lilu by Evelina Wonschuk. She's not a limited edition kit, so you can get her. Um, I think pretty much everywhere sells her, like Irresistibles, MacPherson's sell her so yeah just painting away for some reason I feel slightly tired I don't know it's been a long day today that's for sure there we go all right I cannot I'm really excited about this Emma doll I love this kit and like who knows, she could be in my collection for a temporary moment, but I think I made her once for me, Jackie bought her for me as a Christmas gift from another artist, but um, I just, there's a certain vision I have for this kit, and I think now I could actually make the vision for it, because I'm at that level with my painting, but um. The one she got me for Christmas was really cute. She just wasn't what I was looking for, though. Are you having problems? No, why? Oh, I don't know. I just heard you huffing over there. Oh, I just did that. <laughs> Libby is a cute chubby kit. That's an older uh, Bountiful Baby kit. I am busy. This is only... <laughs> this is only part of my work. I have a lot of things I need to do. I'm waiting for a silicone to come so I can work on these two silicones. One lady's been waiting patiently forever. And so I want to paint them together because when it's silicone work, you really have to get things, um, 
cleared up together so you have space and so I figure if I'm gonna be working on one doll I might as well wait and work on two to clear up the area for two adding hair to a bald spot let's see I, my little world I'd like to ask about adding hair to a bald spot on the back of the baby's back of the head is it possible yeah you can just root into that area if you have matching mohair all right oh she's so cute such a cutie this baby is way too cute good night Jen Does all the dolls have different makes? Yeah, all the dolls I'm working on are different kits right now. Jackie will tell you, I have a lot of dolls in the garage I'm working on. Probably about... I probably have about 15 kits out there. I just work, work, working away. Working my time away. Um, How do you remember which kit you're doing while you're working? I don't know. Just been doing it so long that... I just know which one, but I will tell you a funny story. Um, about a year ago, Jackie and I were making the same prototype. No, that's more than a year ago. Is it a year, more than a year ago? Yeah, like two. Okay, so, oh, it'll be going into two years. So going into two years ago, Jackie and I were making the same prototype. And I was, Jackie had not started hers, and I was just about done with mine. <laughs> <laughs> and I set the baby in the basket like this, like I like I do all the time. No, I, back then I wasn't doing it all the time, but I set it in the basket to show Jackie, and I realized that the doll had, I was just going to say two left legs. The doll had two left legs. And I was like, what the heck? Oh my gosh, my doll kit came with two of the same legs, and I didn't realize that I painted um, two of the same legs will come to realize somewhere along my process, I grabbed Jackie's left leg to her doll. So I was like, oh my goodness. So I had to, my doll was completely done. So I had to take the plain left leg and match it to the rest of my doll, which luckily I was able to do. And surprisingly, Jackie wasn't upset at me for painting her dolls. <laughs> Not a big deal. But that's the first time that's ever happened. But yeah, I'm pretty good at keeping... I know it's funny, like, not only do I know the kits all together and I don't mix up their parts, but I also know that these babies own to this person and I don't keep a list. I'm very horrible at that. So I'm gonna keep a list of who has a doll. And then I also know, like, how each doll is supposed to look. And I've got, like, 15 dolls I'm working on at once. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, don't, you remember that incident? That was pretty funny. I was, I was kind of upset because I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to match it. So, it was really funny. Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to be uh, making the prototype for that Weeby Babies. Um, it was an Asian baby. I don't know, she said something about, something went wrong with the, uh, the, uh, the mold. So it delayed it. I was already supposed to have the Asian doll for Weeby Babies. And then she said another one. So I'm not sure, but we'll see. I love painting on her silicone. I'm excited. So I was a little bummed that the Asian baby got a little delayed, but it's okay. I know she's going to be super awesome. Cannot wait. Cannot wait. So, all right. <laughs> Please don't tell me to shut up. I'm being funny. Oh my gosh, guys, come on. Hopefully nobody's, you know. Uh, Jessica, I'm sorry about your loss. That's awful. Let's see. Okay. Now, I think on this doll, I am going to do a second orange layer. Well, my pretty, I don't know what you would call that. It's like a peach layer, I guess. A peachy color on her and then on all these dolls next we're gonna be working with some blushing you guys let's not be a bully or anything I'd hate for you guys to get in timeout timeouts no fun I always hated timeout when I was you know in school I got put in timeout a lot because I was I always talked back 
I always got my cards pulled to yellow too, but I never really got detention because I think they were scared of my dad. But yeah, it got put in timeout a lot, even at home. Timeout. Timeout was like my favorite spot. Like what? That's a favorite place I like. Uh, why were they scared of my dad? Oh, because he would come down there. And uh, he would bully them. That's why. <laughs> Don't pick on my baby. She's innocent. Yeah, that's pretty much it. There's quite a few people in here. There's, From what I can see, there's 118 people in here. And it's staying really consistent. I'm like really impressed. Like wow, 118 people want to hear me and see what I'm doing. Makes me feel so special. It does. Uh, we when we paint, we like to watch Family Guy, Bob's Burgers, um, different Disney movies. We've started watching Game of Thrones. We're only on season three. We need to get back to watching that so we can get caught up with everybody else in the world. Um, we'll watch American Horror Story. I prefer to watch stuff. But yeah, we do listen to a lot of um, music. Jackie likes to watch a lot of Steven Universe. And uh, what are those other ones? Adventure Time. Adventure Time. And I think that's that's Gravity, a, Falls. Gravity Falls. Those are Jackie shows. So, yeah, we do um, have. There's never really any quiet background time around here. We always have something going. So, yeah, I like to keep stuff on. American Horror Story is really good, and it looks like this season is going to be really good. I have to say, the last season was not good. I was super disappointed. Um, to a point where I wasn't even looking forward to this season. But, after the first episode aired, I definitely am looking forward to hopefully watching it tomorrow. It's Wait, today. is it today? Oh, yeah. today? Oh, shoot! What time is it? <laughs> it's 9. It's 9. It comes on another hour. So today, wow, there's 124 people in here, guys. It's so awesome. Yeah, we should be watching it tonight. Um, so no, it's not come on yet in California. We're still waiting around. Babe, come on. Oh, I thought you could see me with my hand. Oh, no, I can't see you with your hand. No, don't spoil it, dang it. Don't nobody tell me about it. If you're going to talk about it, I'm just going to look down at the floor. And I'm just going to ignore everybody. <laughs> All right. So she's gotten her two layers of orange wash. She's looking so fabulous here. I'm going to... Well, I'm going to make some blushing color. Because I need blushing mix now. So we can get to work on that. First, I have to clean out my um, blushes here. So I'm just going to get a paper towel and get those cleaned out. Right here. That taken out. i got to get my colors. I do not like making new colors. It's always so messy to clean out. Paint gets everywhere. Get out. I think I'll just work with these two colors because I typically kind of use the same blushes. So let me grab the paint that we're going to use. Red and I think these two colors. Alright. So uh, my blush always starts with the base of Genesis Red. I'll put that in there. <laughs> and um, I need a brush to mix my colors with. Here we go. Good color. I'm going to put some Genesis Red in these where I put the thinner. In here. Okay. 
me that like what you're looking at I'm making my paint I'm making my paint I'm making my paint all right now this one is a pyro red 08 you can see that guys it's a pyro red 08 I'm trying to get it to focus a little better here we go okay so I'm gonna put some of that in this color and mix it around see what color I'm getting I'm gonna put some more such a pretty color such a pretty color and some more okay that's a good color for me now we're gonna get the other paint mix into my red which this is a magenta eight <laughs> I'm not the new Bob Ross that's totally Jackie I've learned this from Jackie <laughs> everything pretty much everything I do I've learned from her I just take the paint and I make my own style with it I know it sounds bad but really she has the eye for this stuff Aww. so she teaches me when she's nice to me never she's never nice to me okay so there we go so I've got those two blushing colors going for me Usually I can have like three or four little colors going, but I think I'm going to be mostly working with these two. So, yeah, Jackie teaches, well, she doesn't teach other people, but she, she makes stuff, she shows me it. I've learned from her mistakes, let's just say. Okay. Uh, all right now I've never been to Disney World but those I've talked to have been to Disneyland and Disney World say they prefer Disney World Disneyland sorry <laughs> I make Nirvana onesies for my dolls in pink is your silicone doll preemie yeah she's a micro preemie she's 15 inches if you buy a Luna she's $2,100 with the drink and wet system um, I got her for free because I was, you know, the sculptor asked me to paint her and promote my version of work on her. So she told me to either keep her or sell her. And right now she's a keeper. Yeah, Disneyland's great. I'm, um, we're going to be there next week. Yay! Bean is going to be here on Wednesday and then we'll be in Disneyland on Friday. It's Friday, Friday. Who's not Bean? Bean? Yeah, who's Bean? We don't care about Bean anymore. Okay, <laughs> just kidding. So, we are gonna work with some blushing. Here we go. Um, I have done ethnic giveaway once with a reborn baby. Sometimes I've done giveaways where they're painted kits and they've requested ethnic work, so. But yeah, you're right, I uh, do you see. There's not a lot of ethnic reborn artist it's not as easy as you would think it is um, making those beautiful chocolate <laughs> colors and uh, chocolate I want to make more AA tone not biracial but I'm not it's not my calling like I just it doesn't look as nice as some but those babies that have beautiful chocolate skin tones and there's a lot of undertone work with it so it's not just painting something brown you have to really work well with their undertones. I mean, I can do biracials, but I really would love to make a dark AA baby. One day I'm going to take the time and teach myself. But yeah, so there are more um, Caucasian reborn artists. It's just, you have a calling for the AAs or you don't because you can make them not look nice. So you're right, you don't see much giveaways with I did do a AA giveaway last year. Yeah, Jackie did an AA giveaway last year. Oh, look at that little face. I don't have any preemies for sale right now. I'm sorry. But I have some preemies for sale on eBay. She's looking for biracial. Oh. 
Yeah. And I don't. <laughs> no, we don't. I sorry. I sorry. I so sorry. So right now I'm working with some bushing. Bushing. <laughs> blushing. Right now I'm working with some bushing. Blushing. I may do touch up on the blushing later, but this is just kind of like my base blushing to see um, where I'm going with the doll. So it definitely. Where are you going? <laughs> We're going to Cancun. Me and this baby. She's so cute. I don't know, man. I really think. Hmm. Put upon how this doll turns out, I definitely might put her in my collection. We'll see. I have to be in love with it. I've now, like, told myself, you have to really be in love with them to keep them because you really should be selling them, you naughty girl. So, we'll see. But this kit is hard to get your hands on, and she's such a gorgeous little kit. I love her. Surprised she didn't sell it. Like, surprised her limited edition number is not bigger than what it is because she's such a sweetie. So this is the blushing on the feet. I do the whole bottom pink. And there is a blue undertone right here, which is gonna create like a, like a purpley color, like veins. So I do do the whole bottom pink. And then we pounce off this layer. So we don't wanna bake it that pink. And typically I will have to blush just a little darker in a little later stage um, it's kind of like I do the blushing in layers only two layers really though if I have to add more but we shall see how it turns out there's her little foot so cute the feet see the difference <laughs> when can you call yourself a reborn artist? I don't know. I really just started calling myself one <laughs> like a year or so ago. I don't know. I guess that's in your own terms. I see people just starting and they're calling themselves a reborn artist. I guess it's whatever, whatever feels good for you, right? I have no I idea. I guess when is a person an artist? Yeah, when, it, when is a person an artist? I don't know. I think that's whenever you determine that for yourself. You're an artist. That's a, that's like a trick question, I think. Yes, a little paint goes a long way. You're totally right. Do, 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 do. I like the blushing. It's so much fun. This is one of my favorite layers because like you guys asked yesterday, like favorite layers. Uh, this is one of them because it starts adding just that much more life. Yeah, confidence in your work, Chinza, you're totally right. Confidence in your work can make you an artist. Like, if you're confident in what you're doing, you love what you're doing, people are buying it, there you go. You know, you're selling quality work. It's a good way to look at it. I just cannot believe how many people are still in this chat. That is so crazy. It's crazy and fabulous. That's crazy. Okay, now we're on to the little fingers. Little fingers. She has cute little fingers. We're gonna blush those suckers up. <laughs> <laughs> so why are you laughing? I laugh because you're like cute little fingers and then you're like, okay, we're gonna blush those suckers up. <laughs> You're gonna bust those suckers in. Like if you take away the cuteness to them. Yeah, no, now they're now they're suckers. Now they're suckers. I guess for a baby they would be suckers. Yeah. What do you mean Tambry wasn't really supposed to have lollipops when she was this age? <laughs> How to mess that kid up. Okay, so got my hand blushed. Ah, my chats are awesome. Oh, thank you so much. I'm glad that you guys are enjoying them. It's totally like, I don't know, it's becoming this new thing I like to do because I'm like, oh, people seem to really like them. Jackie calls my fingers sausage fingers. Gosh, <laughs> it's not very nice. Well, put them. Show. You're covering them. What are you doing? Show. Oh, yeah, they are kind of fat. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. 
I, why you so sad, girl? I'm so sad because you made fun of me. You made fun of me. You made me want to cry. <laughs> I've always had large hands. It's nothing new. They're just man hands. I think you were meant to be a boy. Oh, yeah. I was meant to be a boy. <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay, so we've got that hand blushed up. Who should get blocked? Ah, oh, I'm missing out on all the good stuff. I'm busy painting away. You guys are all having your own drama over there. Ah. Well, there's people in here that could be doing the blocking. I like all types of music. Uh, definitely don't have just one reference so I like uh, everything country alternative uh, his Latino, Hispanic. <laughs> Hispanic music I don't know reggaeton what do you call it Mexican music Latin music Latin music Mex there is such thing as Mexican music I love uh, reggaeton music like with ceiling and nail I like I prefer Pitbull when he sings in Spanish. Um, some other ones I like too. I would rock. I like everything. I just don't like the rap that I can't understand. Oh my gosh, what's going on? What's going on? Fighting with a 12 year old because she can't eat hot Cheetos at 10 p.m. I missed two. I was fighting. Man, I totally missed two. What's going on, Xenia? Tell us who we need to report. Draw them all over the place. Xenia's got it down. Xenia will tell you guys what's going on. Garth Burke, yeah, that was my first concert I ever went to. If there's someone we need to block, just give us their name. There's a lot of people in here. I'm missing it because I got my head down concentrating. And everybody's over there having drama. Man, everybody's missing it too. Monstrous Little Beast is having, is missing it. <laughs> the Jonas Brothers, aww. Cute. I love the Jonas Brothers. Yeah. Now I like Nick Jonas by himself. He sure has come around that guy. He was like a dorky little guy. Let's see. I'm looking. Nelson Twins. I have no idea who that is. I have seen Bob Dylan in concert. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, that's funny. Un poco punto. Huh? 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 Is that a band? Mm. He was your favorite before he was cool. Well, now he's my favorite because he's cool. Garth Brooks is an amazing performer, Nick Jonas. Yeah, Garth Brooks really puts on a good show. I was 13 when I saw him. It was an amazing show. That was before he retired and came back. So can you imagine what a show was like back then? It's probably better. Let's see. Lisa Marie Presley. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, NSYNC. <laughs> uh, I always loved Lance on Instinct. Uh, Instinct. Instinct. <laughs> Instinct. Instinct. That's for sure. Instinct. <laughs> <laughs> Lou Johnson was being rude. Ah, everybody missed him but you. That's crazy. Nobody was paying attention. It's because it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I guess everybody just... Well, I guess it was really bad because I kept seeing somebody say, Block him, block him, block him. He probably ran away. He got scared. Let's see. Wow. All right. You saw the Beatles in 1965? Wow. Wow. Dang. I wasn't even alive. My mom wasn't even alive. I'm not trying to age people. I'm just like... Your mom wasn't alive in... My mom wasn't alive in 1965. No. My mom was. She was too. Oh, I know. I mean, my mom was 32 in 1965. <laughs> <laughs> Because my mom's 70. Damn. Ah. Ah. Don't let my mom lie to you, 
you guys. She's 74. <laughs> she hates it when I do that. All right. So, I guess... I'm guessing we're going to have to move on to my other little babies. Because this one I blushed up. Now I gotta have Jackie start. You were 14 in 1965. Alright. I think my... No, my dad was two. Your dad was two in 1965? Yeah. My dad was 30. <laughs> no, my dad was only two in 1965, and my mom was 34 in 1965. Ew! <laughs> my mom's probably not even paying attention to this chat she's too wound up tight and PewDiePie you're not as old as dirt you know what if you're healthy you're as young as you feel I see okay I'll look at your pictures Valerie when I'm back on there yeah my mom will watch this later I could be Jackie's mom yeah, you could probably be my mom too. No, I'm just no, kidding. <laughs> that didn't come across as and that it was, should have. Oh, Jackie has no idea who I'm talking about. It was Amanda. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Amanda? <laughs> I'm cool with that. I love Amanda. <laughs> oh my goodness. I was like, who are you talking to like that? <laughs> Saying you could be my mommy. You can be my mommy. I'm gonna go live with Amanda. Well, get out of here. I couldn't pack your bags quick enough, girl. I don't need anything from you. That's good. That's good. You just, you just get on out of here. Just remember, you're an hour drive from Target. I don't know how you'll survive. <laughs> Probably won't make it. Okay, so back to the little zombie. We're gonna work with, whoa, this arm draw. Weird. I'm gonna work with its blushing. Okay, can you hold up the doll in the background that has painted hair? What? This doll? This one? It doesn't have anything going on with it right now. It just I just took out its eyes and put these zombie well these like zombie looking eyes. They probably don't know that it's the Walmart doll. Oh, this is the Walmart um Behringer doll, you guys know the Asian baby that I just made? Um, this is it. I have another one to make. I just haven't, I don't know, I haven't figured it out. Yeah, it's got the albino eyes in there. I stuck them in there because there's the only eyes I had to put in there. <laughs> Chinza sent me these eyes. And he had ugly plastic eyes. So yeah, I might be making another one of these to sell. Doot, doot, or making it as a custom. So if you're interested in a custom of this doll, <laughs> feel free to message me. <laughs> one to 10, how much do I like reborning? Oh, I love it, it's great. As an experienced artist, what's your opinion on selling the not so good? Uh, just let them bid. Put them up there and let them bid. You know, if you have dolls that you're just like... My first doll that I let bid on eBay it only bid for like $70. I'm glad you cut me off right now. Just saying. <laughs> yeah, my first doll I put on eBay, I think it bid for $85. It was a little more than Jackie's. So, first time babies, just start um, letting them bid on eBay. Yeah, if somebody wants a custom Asian baby with this baby's head and the Ashley limbs again... <laughs> Please contact me. I will make it. For sure. I, elsewise, it's, it's oh, just sitting shizzle. here. Or chisels my knees ha 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 Okay, so we're going to work on some blushing on this. This little guy has like zombie eyes. Hold on. Look at its eyes are pretty. The mom is going to love this baby. Oh my gosh. She's going to love it. Oh, that's a cheek color I like. I'm going to have to redo the last kit that I put away because this is the cheek color I like. I'll walk it. I'll watch. 
So I'm going to have to bring that baby back over here. And her cheeks didn't blush as well as I wanted. Actually, I may be doing her feet too because... Ah, oh, this baby's so cute! I love this baby! Oh my gosh, so cute. This baby is so adorable. It just makes like the perfect flesh-eating zombie. That's for sure. It's just like, ah, uh, so cute. Okay. So, I lost some of my comments. I'm going to start reborning. Do you have advance oh, advice? I'm going to have to make a whole separate video for advice. Because that's going to be a lot. Not just something we could chit chat in here for a couple of minutes. Oh my gosh. I love this doll. Oh, look at it. It's so freaking awesome. Totally love it. Love, love, love it. Can you get a preemie baby Luna and baby Luna and paint it? Uh, if you provide me a Luna. No, this is not Saskia. This is um Abby by AK Kitagawa. Yeah, best advice, trial and error. <laughs> Don't quit when the going gets rough. Just keep going. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Oh, let's swim, guys. Let's go swimming together. We're going to go. We're swimming together. We're in the bubbles. Yeah. How do we get out of here? There we go. This one doesn't have a belly plate. I don't have any belly plates that I'm working on right now. Do you not have any? So we're swimming together. Swimming together. <laughs> Am I going to film my mom's birthday? Yeah, we'll be at Disneyland. Of course I'm going to film it. I haven't been there in forever. So we're going to film it. For shizzle, my nizzle. For chisel. Okay, well, well, when the bubbles come across, it's really hard to see stuff. All right. We can have disco fever in here. Like, what? What? Dance party. This one's called dance party. You really can't see anything that's going on now. Just keeping it. We're just, we're just keeping you guys entertained. Maybe we're going to have to leave this one. That's kind of like hard on the eyes. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Back to normal. All right, so much for having fun with that. We're going back to normal. Back to reality. That was a song. That was an older song. Okay, so I've got some paint and the crease on my nails. So I just take my blending brush. <laughs> blending brush? My, br uh, my blending brush and just blend that out a little bit. Okay, over here, got some paint I need to blend. Dun, 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 dun. All right, what's going on? There we go, got this one little hand blushed. Though he's a zombie, he doesn't need much blushing, but he's a different kind of zombie. He's not like, he's like transitioning from being alive to being a zombie. Yes, yes he is. He's alive, and then he's a zombie. Slowly changing over. So I think that's how he's supposed to be painted. I don't know. Yeah, I don't make ugly zombies. I still keep them rather cute. Uh, I need to see if my mom wants me to put a bite on him. The bites are cool, too. I used to make bites on my zombies. All 3D-like and everything. Pretty neat. Pretty talented, if you ask me. Do I ever modify them? I, some people do modify them. Oh my gosh. For the millionth time. I've answered this question for the millionth time too. It's the Abby by um, A.K. Kirigawa. Okay. So there we are. We got the hand blushed. Gotta go in here with my creasing brush. And get some paint out of the way. There we are. Woohoo! Making progress, making babies. Progress making babies. This baby is so adorable. I love it. 
Now onto the feet. We're blushing the feet. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Blushing away, blushing away. I like to let it sit for like a second. <laughs> Uh, Abby is, she is, I actually, um, donated my painting services on this doll. I haven't really talked much about this doll, but, um, the lady's been through a lot in the last couple of years. Like, and I know who this lady is. So, I wanted to just donate the work to her, and so I did. So, it's a, it's like, I guess it's like a giveaway that never really took place publicly, but it's something special for its mommy, so not a custom. I mean, it is a custom, but it's on that lines of this was a giveaway doll for her kind of thing. We've been together seven years. We seem so perfect. Oh my gosh. No. You guys have not seen what took place. No. <laughs> We're like every other couple. We have our arguments. Um, but yeah, it's always a learning experience. You see, my wedding ring is off. <gasps> I told you! I'm single. Single and ready to mingle, guys. She's awful. <laughs> well, Jackie told me she didn't want to be with me anymore. <laughs> she told me she didn't love me, so I took it off. What, you what are you such a liar. Hey, we were arguing. When we argue, Jackie says the meanest things. Just saying, everybody does it. But look, Amanda says, oh my God, Jackie. I know, I know, right? Jackie's cray cray. Oh my God, Jackie what? <laughs> that, that, that my ring is off. <laughs> See, she says, you got with the Latina stuff. We are spicy. You guys are spicy crazy. Freaking A, man. Bipolar is just the new definition. Yeah, you guys are nuts. I just don't even know what to say. Well, you're still here. <laughs> well, this is my house. <laughs> I paid, man, I paid the rent. <laughs> it's our house, honey. But I am single. Look at that. Look at that, guys. One more time. No more ring. Oh, why is it going blurry every time I go to show you guys? <laughs> yeah, so, no. We are in love, but I'm just punishing her right now. She told me to put it back on, and I told her no. That she has to earn it for me to put it back on. <laughs> you gotta earn it if you want to put a ring on my finger. Put a ring on my finger, you gotta earn it. <laughs> my favorite food is spaghetti, back when I ate carbs. Like that, uh, but now it's keto pizza. I really like keto pizza. Oh no, Jackie makes some fried chicken. Don't say my name! <laughs> when, we, when we were married, Jackie... No, don't say my name! <laughs> when we were married, Jackie used to make this fried chicken that was really good, but... <laughs> Date Saturday night stuff. Oh, look, I'm already getting offers. What? <laughs> yeah, best of luck. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, I'm taking advice from Montress Little Bees. Her and her husband married 12 years. They never wear rings. <laughs> That's how they get free drinks at the bars. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I, we've been married for... Well, we just divorced yesterday. <laughs> but we were married, what, three years? Four years? 2013. I had to do the math on this not too long ago. I'm going to take Jackie out, says Montrose Little Bees. Ugh, I don't think your husband's going to like that. I just don't think two Latina girls are going to mesh well together. You guys will probably kill each other. You ever seen those roosters fight? You ever seen cock fights? That will be two Latina girls. Ah! I had it first! Ah, now you had it first! Ah! Ah! I'm dead! I'm dead! Okay, fine, wait. Like that. That's how the arguments go. Just saying. <laughs> oh, I got another date offer. <laughs> That's fine. You can go. <laughs> Where are we gonna go? I'm oh, just kidding. Everybody's laughing. Now. Look, you guys, you made everybody's night. 
So yeah, we do seem perfect together, but we do have our problems, just like everybody else. Nobody's perfect. I gotta work it. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you're the same way, Stephanie. See, and I think you're with a Latina girl too. Oh, it's gotta be something about that. Latina and white, they're gonna fight. Yep. Oh, somebody else wants to take Jackie out too. Let's see. Amanda says, <laughs> Everyone has problems. My husband's ring is hot glued on. Whoa. <laughs> I think you should have not hot glued it, but you should have. Cut his skin where his ring is, and then sewed his ring into his skin. What the hell? You are twisted. No, it's because it could never come off. If you hot glue, hot glue comes off. <laughs> you know where I got that from? Yes. It's yes. that movie. What's that movie called? We just watched. Oh, honeymoon. Oh, watch a movie called Honeymoon. Oh my God. I'll never go running alone. Tattoo rings. I can just. Be a good idea, I suppose. Uh, if you guys want to see good honeymoon, for those of you who don't speak habla espanol, you will need to read the subtitles, but it's really good. <laughs> and um, it's called Honeymoon. Super good. Is it on Netflix, babe? I oh, I mean, uh, Jackie, is it on Netflix? You're no longer my babe. <laughs> I'm not your babe. I'm, I'm not, not your, your babe. babe. Don't call me. Fernando. <laughs> Don't call my name. Don't call my name. No. Do you speak Spanish? No. I do understand a bit of it, but no, I don't. <sighs> oh my. What time is it? Is it time to watch our show yet? No. Um. It's not our show, Stephanie. <laughs> no wonder Tamri is awesome. She has two goobers as parents. Yeah. And then she has her grandma too, which try to, you know, not allow her grandma to be such a bad influence on her. But yeah, we try to keep her sane, Tamri. She probably is like, man, my mom and Jackie are a mess sometimes. I'm just going to be single forever. And ever, and ever, ever. You love my mom. She's sassy. <sighs> She's bossy lately. She's bossy lately. Does Tambri babysit you all? Which, oh yeah, sometimes I'll be like, Tambri, come here, you heard this. And then Jack will be like, don't break her into it. I'm like, no, but seriously, we had a witness. Sometimes. It is our show, Jackie has to share. Cause I bought the TV. <laughs> what are you looking for over there? Did your mom leave? Did my mom leave? And she went outside. So did she leave? No, her car is there. I wonder, I wonder if she can hear us. No, not on that one. If I go over here to the camera? Mm -mm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let me see. Let me turn this this way. We got a new alarm system. Let's see if you... Oh, we can zoom in. Oh, sweet! All right, cool. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. I don't mean for you to see my face so much. We'll go right there. God, your eyes are red. Yeah, they're tired. Mom, are you out there? <laughs> Come closer to the door so I can hear you. <laughs> what are you doing outside? I can hear her talking back, but I can't hear her. I love this system because now we can stalk you. <laughs> I need a camera over there where you're sitting. That's what I'm going to get installed next. A camera. <laughs> this is so awesome. Okay. Let's zoom that back in. <laughs> yeah, so we got this alarm system installed. It's Vivian. It's really cool. But I gotta get a, a camera so I can see my mom. Like right now we can see, no it's not Xfinity, it's called Vivient, V-I-V-A-N-T I believe. Really cool system, I like it. So um, 
Yeah, but we can see the camera, like, we can see our cars, and, um, we can't see where my mom hangs out. But the doorbell, when you press the doorbell, I can talk to people at the door and they can talk back to me. And it's got a camera so I can see your full body out there. It's really neat. So when you ring the doorbell, it activates the camera. And I love it. It's really cool. It's like 70 bucks a month because we have add-ons like, you know, payment plans into our add-on. But without the add-ons, it's I think it's... I don't know. I don't know how much it is. 69 a month or something. It's worth it. I mean, you know what? It's better to be safe than sorry, right? Love it. So it even has like... They installed it on Saturday and stuff. Hey, look at you, girl. What you doing back there? Did you find yourself a new man? <laughs> <laughs> I will never tell you. You want... Now that we're done, you will know nothing of me. <laughs> well, get out of the kitchen. <laughs> no, I'm working. I gotta finish my customs before I move out. Well, I said I don't. You said that you were gonna leave. <laughs> oh, I'm nice. just renting this little space right here. Well, your rent is past due, <laughs> and I want a thousand dollars for your little space. Uh, Tambri's asleep. Yeah, it's great to have that doorbell because uh, we were getting doorbell ditchers, so now I can't wait. Somebody just offered them to marry you. Okay, hit me up. She's expensive, just saying. And she's demanding. And, yeah, she cleans house pretty good, though. Makes food pretty good. <laughs> You're so funny. You're so funny, Jackie. You're so funny. I cannot believe all these people still hanging around here. This is crazy. Amanda, don't lie. She's not super sweet. But she does force drinks and stuff upon you like every five seconds. Are you sure you're not thirsty? Are you sure you're not thirsty? You want no soda? <laughs> I'm sorry, babe. Oh, oh I'm being Jackie. Don't call me babe. Call me Fernando. Alejandro. Oh, Alejandro. <laughs> Where did I get Fernando from? <laughs> oh, that's my boyfriend's name. Fernando. <laughs> yeah, we're crazy. Totally crazy. Wait, I hit a gold mine. Man, she hit a gold mine. What are you talking about? Just because I have my hair done right now. <laughs> I I did hit a gold mine. I was looking for the young ones. Seven years younger. Got to keep them young. She's getting old. Almost into her 30s. Another. Recycle that pinto in. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get mad when I when I do it before you do. Okay? There is evidence on YouTube that you were gonna trade me in anyway, so <laughs> I might as well just save you the headache. And do it myself. <laughs> Because it's funny. They know I'm kidding, though. Uh, Jackie doesn't do lives because she's not as funny as I am. <laughs> no, if I do a live, I would never paint. If she did a live, she'd just be like here in the camera. Oh, I have a pimple. Let me pop it. <laughs> oh, I have this other... That's all she does at the table. She gets her mirror out. She's like, oh, I'm picking at my face for the 500th time. <laughs> so, no. So, she'd be right here in the camera be like, oh, my God, I can see everything. <laughs> so, and then she would zoom in like this. Whoop, whoop. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> and if she had a live, she'd be like, Stephanie, are you gonna join me and make it funny? <laughs> and I'm like, no, make your own stuff funny. That's what she does to me. <laughs> and instead, I'm over here having my good old time, and she has to jump in every time. I don't know you anymore. Good. We're not related. Well, I'm sleeping in the bed tonight. I'm flipping on the First off, side. we were never related because that would just be sick. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> I don't know you anymore. I don't know who you are anymore. God, you used to be so... No, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. I'm not wearing support. Oh, that's right. You don't have a bra on. <laughs> ah! Ah! So funny. Gross. <laughs> gross. This is gross. I don't know how you do that. <laughs> and no makeup. Way to point that one out. 
<laughs> that's it. That's it. I'm not going to talk to you guys no more. <laughs> That's a MJO baggage. No bra. Oh my god. I know. <laughs> Boobies are free. <laughs> Get it, girl. <laughs> oh, this is a wild that, that, chat this tonight. This was a PG-13 Hey, channel. kids are kids are in bed now, man. This is all adults. <laughs> All adults. Do, 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 do. Oh, I love this live chatting. Yeah, I have purpose in my life now. These live chats. They're so fun. Uh, Molly's in the bedroom, so I'm not going to go get her. But... Uh, <laughs> so he so said, Dude, I've been sick and now I'm wide awake, so keep it going. <laughs> I know, I'm like, man, there is so many people hanging on to this chat conversation thing. I'm thinking, dang. <laughs> people are still stuck on the no bra. <laughs> They're like recording. Isn't that normal? They're like, what? Go back, go back. I want to see Jackie. Let me see what she's got. Put it back there. They're getting smaller. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> I love bras. I just couldn't imagine not wearing one. Why are you blurry, camera? Gosh. Okay. We got the blushing done on this little monster. Now, I'm going to bring back the other baby because I just, oh, man. See, I was going to put this away and I noticed right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's like a line in my blushing. So, I actually have to blend that. It's good to check that because you don't want to cook like like a straight line like you really applied paint. You want it to look natural. So I like to double check that on my stuff. Is my mom out there? I think so. Oh. Ask her if she could hear us. No. Don't be dumb. Okay, so I'm going to put this baby. Oh, I got another line right there. Okay, split that. I'm going to put this baby back, and I'm going to bring back this one, because the, um, Emma, I want to do her blushing with this other blush that I like so much better. I like to do my blushing a pretty good color, because then, like, as I'm adding some other layers, it blends, and it looks natural, so I kind of, like, put it on a little darker than normal at the beginning. But, like I said, I do other washes, so it makes the blushing look very natural. So, that's where I'm going with this. I'm just adding a little bit more blushing in here. All, you know, we go from, like, joking conversation to, like, serious conversation. Like, we're going to paint, guys. That's what we've got going on. How many people love this girl? I love myself. Me. Oh, my gosh. I just cannot believe how many people are in this chat. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're zoomed in. We're not. We're zoomed in. Go back to normal. Oh my gosh, I swear. Okay. We're having a lot of fun. These chats are great. Like, I just, you know, I used to do the Molly Live chats, but they're not as fun as this. I mean, they're fun in their own way, but this is a lot of fun. Really enjoy hanging out with you guys. You guys are a great group. And it seems like, I mean, I'm kind of almost on this, like, do a live chat nightly. I'm just in here painting, so I'm like, I don't know why I don't entertain and paint. But I do notice I don't get as much done when I'm on the live chat because I'm, like, taking a break and trying it up. I know she looks really red to you guys, but definitely she's not. Um, okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. I'm going to bust her feet again. Whoa, okay, serious? I don't know why it's gone blurry. Like, I feel like it's zoomed in. I don't know. Come on. <gasps> no! Ah! I just dropped the paint. Man. Well, it was empty, but I dropped the glass and it broke. Ah! Ah! Here it is. Broken glass. Not the first time. You don't have a honey. I don't got a honey to help me. 
Ah! I don't have nobody. There we go. It was zoomed in. Okay. At least it wasn't full with thinner. Oh my gosh. When you drop those bottles and they have thinner in them, they're the worst thing to clean because the thinner makes the floor super oily. And like, no matter what you try, you can't, um, I know I need to, uh, I need one of these glass pieces. There's a lot of glass though. At least I have shoes on. I'm trying to move it around. But the thinner makes it super slippery. And like I've even sprayed the thinner with bleach but it just doesn't help. But yeah. So. Okay, so there we go. That's the blushing color I like. Dish soap and magic eraser. Oh, okay, cool. Try that next time. You bringing me the broom, honey bunny? No. Why not? I <laughs> Absolutely in love with my work. I do payments. Anybody that's in love with my work, I do payments. Don't be afraid to ask. I think I have pretty reasonable payment plans. So, if you're in love with my work, just always ask. We can do payments. How does it usually work? Um, well, if you're getting a custom, I don't start the doll until it's fully paid is the off. Other dog food in the car? Yes, it is. So, and I don't think he ate yesterday either. I don't start the doll until it's fully paid off. But if, um, and that usually just requires not like, I don't know. It just depends if you're getting like a painted kit or something and you're providing. You know what? Just email me. Yeah, email me. We can work out the details because there's a lot of questions I can ask. I could be here all day. I mean, not that. I mean, I know you guys want me here all day. Front door. Mom. What? Did you hear me talking to you out there? No. You didn't? Oh, I was pressing the doorbell. I thought you could hear me because it sounded like you were talking back. Well, I mean, it sounded like somebody talking in the distance. Oh, that's crazy. Well, never mind. I was hearing things. It sounded like it. I heard it too. Yeah, it sounded Maybe like Maybe she was on the, on the phone. Oh, she could have been listening to her PewDiePie. Yeah, my PewDiePie. She's so in love with that guy. Would you paint a kit if we send it to you? Yes. Please email me. Totally will. You guys just go ahead and message me and I will, um, we can talk about prices and stuff like that. It's hard to talk about those kind of things on live, uh, because like, I don't know what kit you want and I, and I'm not looking at the screen totally. So yeah, just message me privately. Like I said, uh, 18 and over if you're under 18. Please have your parents message me unless like I've done business with you. I've done business with some minors, so I already ha I already know like they don't have to have their parents message me. But I need to avoid recently I've had a lot of children emailing me asking for free to hauls. Or asking for custom prices and then they're like, I'm only twelve and I'm like, Why in the world are you asking for a price if you're only twelve? A lot of emails like that recently. Okay, me and your mom, we love the pews. Oh, my mom loves him. She watches him non-stop, like crazy. I even had to join in one of his live chats and give him money, just so I could tell him um, <laughs> how my mom was obsessed with him. He read the comment too, it was pretty funny. So I was like, that's hilarious. All right, I touched up. This one's blushing, like I wanted to do. All right. Oh, I'm falling in love with this baby. Why do you look so white? Oh, my mom's opinion on the latest PewDiePie scandal. I don't know why it's getting so bright. I think, you know, he didn't mean any harm. It was just... She, it's just like he's just playing his game, you know, and words slipped out. Just, you know, we all make those mistakes. It's 
when you're that big of a guy, he's only he's only going to be cotton scandals. <laughs> it's like he's huge. He's more famous than some celebrities, you know. But I think she just said, you know, he was just playing his game and he didn't mean any foul play. So yeah, we're only human, basically. Sometimes, you know, we also but shouldn't be. You're right. Because, you know, how is he really using the word outside of it? But maybe he heard it in the game. I don't know. But, yeah. It just... It just can't speak for other people. Just have no idea. My mom loves candy corn. I don't like candy corn. Yeah, content. The way it was said. Totally. Totally. Content is important. Hey, do you have shoes on? No. Because just the glass just broke right here. I mean, Jackie. Jackie, I don't want you to cut yourself. I don't want to be cutting It's just a candy. You eat it. You know who has the best candy corn? Is the Jelly Belly Factory. It does. It does have the best candy corn. It's, it's a candy that's shaped like a triangle like this, and it's like orange, white, and yellow. It's just really a bunch of sugar. It's really... I know I need to sweep this area, but nobody brought me a broom or anything. I have no assistance without a wife. I'm going to pick up some more of these pieces because there's some bigger pieces down here. It's the littler ones that I'm more afraid of because they'll get in your foot and they will really hurt. But I will try to pick them up. I need to vacuum them. Okay, I got a few more pieces. All right, already. I don't know, my mom loves candy corns. And she loves those uh, Halloween pumpkins. Those pumpkin ones that, that are like the same thing as candy corns, but they're pumpkins. Use bread for the smaller pieces. Oh, that's a smart one. I'm going to get some bread. Okay, we're going to get that picked up. So, I'm going to get a slice of bread. All right, now. That's all I need. Let's see, Lady Gaga, oh nice. Is it French bread? Shut up Amanda, no it's not. It's rainbow bread. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda knows. I'm so mad at her about that. Why? Because she wasn't a fatty with me that day. Okay, so I'm using the bread. Now the thing is, is use the bread, but don't eat the bread. <laughs> <You should. laughs> oh man. Hey, this is working pretty well. I would have never. That's a life hack. Yeah. I would have never thought to use bread to get these pieces of glass. Wow. That's so awesome. Oops, there's one right there. That's cool. I picked up the bread. I mean, the glass. <laughs> <laughs> you so funny. You funny, funny, funny. Yeah, it worked really good. There's a few, I mean, I gotta get another piece of bread because my bread gets squishy. But yeah. Because she's gonna eat that piece of bread. I'm gonna eat that piece of bread. I'm not gonna eat it. This works really good. You just press it down on the shards. Oh my God, really? And then what? And then it picks it up. Oh my God. Yeah, like crazy. It's really picking it up well. But do not eat it. You can feed it to your bad spouses. <laughs> if your spouse is talking back, give them a piece of bread full of glass. <laughs> ah, this is so awesome. I love it. I can be here all day. Good thing you're divorced. Yep. I mean, it's really picking it up super well. Wow, that was a genius idea. Your genius. Love it. Okay, that worked out. 
There's like one piece of glass I keep stepping on. Though. I keep. I think I was getting caught in my shoe. Nope. Sorry. Yes. Okay. Cool. Cool, yo. We got that taken care of. Where did all my things go? Um, I'm trying to read comments. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. We'll have to marry again. Marry again? When she does her makeup and puts on a bra. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know what we're going to be for Halloween. We never even thought about that. I usually like to do like zombie-like things. I love messing with that latex paint. Love it. So, no bra, no wedding, exactly. So, tell the truth, girl, tell the truth. Um, I paused the show for you. What show? Even though... Oh, it's already started? Yeah, yeah but don't you want to let the commercials and stuff so we can just fast forward through it? It's yeah. 10.09. Oh, American Horror... Oh. You can send a drawing of whatever you want to, Sylvia. What? She keeps asking to send a drawing. Um, American Horror Story started, guys. Yeah, we, but we're gonna let the commercials. We have it on pause right now, so the commercials. So we like we can fast forward it. You know, let it play for like fifteen minutes, and then fast forward it. But I'm gonna get in the shower. What? Why? In the meantime. Don't shower. Be a dirty girl. No, that's your job. Uh, I don't want to take your job away. Oh, come here. Say hello. Hi. Say hello. Hi. You just hit me in the face. Sana sana colita de rana. Nina should probably go to bed if she's 10 and wide awake. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Bedtime. Unless, I mean, what part of the world she is. Unless... She's homeschooled. It's a different, different thing. Everybody's saying hi to you. We're not going to miss it. We just got on pause, so then it gives us a chance to fast forward through the commercials. So then you take an hour show and you make it half an hour long. <laughs> we don't, I don't like commercials. I do not. But, yeah. I think I'm going to jump off now because I need to um, put my babies in the oven. Sino sana hoy señores mañana. Oh yes, that thing never works. I still hurt after you say that. I'm telling you, it still hurts. It still hurts me. I tell her the thing is hocus pocus. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I am gonna go for now because I want to bake my babies before the show starts, so that way when the show's over. I don't believe. And when the show is over, I can um, start back in on, in on them. So yeah. All right, guys. I had a lot of fun with all of you guys. You guys are so much fun. I can't believe how many people are still in here, and I hate to cut you all off. But we will be back together again, probably for sure tomorrow night. I love these lives. It's a lot of fun. So I'm thinking for sure tomorrow evening. But you guys... Have a good rest of your evening or a start to your day. And thank you so much for watching.